This was just a joyous day for some young Denver Nuggets fans, and not just because of the NBA Finals. Denver 7's Jessica Porter has more on the new STEM lab the team dedicated at the R3 Johnson Boys and Girls Club. How special is yeah, that? The kids were <laughs> so excited today, and you know the Nuggets, they won big in Game 1 last night of the NBA Finals, and the kids at the Boys and Girls Club won big today with their very new STEM lab. Now the team says these partnerships are all about leaving a lasting legacy in the Denver community. To all the kids here, I, the club teaches us to dream big. Let's dream big for ourselves and the Denver Nuggets. Some very lucky kids got to shoot hoops with the pros at the Arthur E. Johnson Boys and Girls Club in Denver. The team still riding high off their win Thursday night. Man, we ran out there. It was so loud. I don't think I've heard anything that loud. The NBA and the Denver Nuggets dedicated a new STEM lab to the club, which serves many kids from homes without internet access. First off, it shows them that they matter, right? That they're coming out here today to take this time to be with our kids. Second, it helps our kids see the opportunities and set their own dreams and their heights higher than they ever could have imagined on their own. The new lab has fresh paint, wall graphics, updated flooring, new furniture and STEM technology. STEM center, you have this gym, take advantage of this opportunity. You have all these things at your finger at your fingertips and uh, just use it and have fun with it and embrace the moment. The Nuggets donated $45,000 for the new lab through the NBA Cares program, which gave the team funding to donate to charity for making it to the Western Conference Finals and the NBA Finals. The Nuggets have had a long time partnership with this particular Boys and Girls Club. So much of the reason why people get involved in professional sports is to help build these community assets. And I think it's also, you know, when, when you show your support for the community, the fans stick with you through thick and thin. And many of the kids were saying how this was the second time that they met some of the players today as the team holds a holiday party there every single year. And guys, I just think it's so incredible that they have such a strong relationship with this community organization. Also, just right in the middle of, of this of first this, victory. Yeah, these day after the yeah. game, you're out there shooting hoops with the kids. How That's fun. How fun. Thanks, Thanks Jess. Jess.